A very warm welcome to you. Thank you for joining us again in this tutorial. In our tutorial today, we are going to learn how to connect Etsy to Facebook. So here, I'm on my Etsy homepage. So you'll come to the top right corner, click on your account, and then come to account settings and click on account settings. That will open your account where you can see about you, all the details up to down here where you can change your email and even close your account. So your interest should be the second part, which is security. You click on security and then you come down here. You notice we have connect your Facebook account. So we also, we also have connect your Google account. And these are all called third party accounts where you connect your third party accounts to your Etsy account to sign in and check out faster. You have added a third party account. You can disconnect any time here. So you click on connect your Facebook account and then you select your account and click on continue. And then it will ask you if you need to edit the access here. Etsy is requesting, Etsy is requesting access to your name, profile, pictures, and email. You can edit access here where you can now decide that it will not access your email. It will also maybe access just the picture. That's why you edit that and then you click on continue. So you notice now your account is now connected to Facebook. And now here you notice Facebook account connected to, you notice our account here has been connected. And so now once this is connected, if I click on this directly, I just click on that. It will take me directly to my Facebook page. I can now click on go to news feed. And you notice it takes me directly to now my Facebook page. For some reason, you would want to disconnect your account from this. If for some reason you want now to disconnect your account from Etsy, your Facebook account from Etsy, you simply go to your Etsy account again. You click at the top here. Then you go to account settings. And then again, under security, you'll scroll down and you notice we have our Facebook here. But if you want to see all the connections, if you click on that and then you come to account settings and click on privacy, you notice here under privacy settings, under findability, do you want others to be able to find by you by email? You can check that. But the second one here, do you want your friends to be able to find you by your Facebook account? You can switch off this one, but you can also switch it on depending on what you would want. And this consent uses basic site functions and cookies. And then, and so you can change those settings down here. But if now you want to deactivate your account, you simply come back to account settings here and then you click on account settings then you click on uh, security and then you come down here you notice your facebook account is connected you click on this x here that way and once you click on that you notice your account has been disconnected from facebook so that's how easy to connect it and you can also connect to your Apple account by just clicking on Apple account here. And then you can also connect to your Google. If you click on connect to Google, it will give you all the emails that have been logged in. And then you can choose the email that you want to link that with. And it is still so easy. I'll link it to the first account there. You click on that. Then it will, then it will automatically be linked. You notice Google account has been connected to this account. So if I click on that email, it directly takes me to my Gmail. You notice now I'm on Google Workspace updates just directly from my Etsy and I can view what I need down here in terms of community features, Google chat, all this by just clicking on that link that is already on Etsy. You notice here under privacy settings, under findability, do you want others to be able to find by you by email you can check that but the second one here do you want your friends to be able to find you by your facebook account 
you can switch off this one but you can also switch it on again to disconnect that you simply do the same come to the same account and then click on the x here and then that will automatically you notice now your account has been disconnected from google and that is simply how you connect your etsy account to your facebook and of course a bonus i've shown you how to add that to google and even to apple account is the same you just click on apple account and then and then you put your phone number here and the email and then you follow the same procedure and then your account will be added and then again under security you'll scroll down and you notice we have our facebook here but if you want to see all the connections if you click on that and then you come to account settings and click on privacy you notice here under privacy settings under findability do you want others to be able to find by you by email you can check that but the second one here do you want your friends to be able to find you by your facebook account you can switch off this one but you can also switch it on depending on what you would want and this consent uses basic site functions and cookies and then and so you can change those settings down here after these have been linked you can continue managing your etsy account just as usual you can search for the items just the normal way that you search but remember linking your facebook page on etsy does not really affect your search related items and all that it makes your logging in easy and switching on between uh, between facebook and etsy account so you notice nothing has been affected in terms of my listing if i come to my shop manager you notice my shop preferences my shop name nothing has been affected here so notice all the details have just remained as they were i can even view the regions the local shops here and then and then i can still view my updates at the top here nothing has been affected and then i can also view my messages here my etsy registry if i need to just the same same way you notice nothing has been affected by just linking my facebook page to my etsy so i hope this has been helpful I hope this has been helpful kindly like this video share and subscribe to our youtube channel